Hello friends, today I am going to discuss about partial decoding and linear decoding. So there is a question by uh, following this question I will answer the partial decoding and linear decoding. So there is a question you can see that a 16 bit microprocessor has 32 bit address bus and it is connected to single 2 megabyte RAM chip to increase the capacity to 6 megabyte. How many RAM chips are required? Show the interfacing connection of the RAM chips to the microprocessor buses using linear and partial decoding. So here are 3 RAM chips are required because because uh, we have to increase the 2 megabyte RAM chip to 6 megabyte and to make it 6 uh, we have to multiply it 3 with 2 so 3 multiplied 2 is equals to 6 so we need 3 RAM chips so if we go for linear decoding in linear decoding uh, you can see that uh, actually we need that 16-bit uh, microprocessor as it is 16-bit we have to take D naught here you can see that I have taken uh, D naught to D15 as it is a 16-bit microprocessor and read and write operation and here I have taken A naught to A20 why it's A naught from uh, A0 from A20 because uh, because uh, you can see here that uh, here is 32 bit address bus we have to take 32 bit addresses and uh, this is in uh, megabyte okay in megabyte it's like 2 to the power 20 as it is 2 to the power 20 uh, for 1 megabyte we have to take a naught from a 19 as it is 2 megabyte so we have to take a naught from a 20 and others are uh, from A21 to A31 so there are three RAM chips so I have connect uh, D15 and D0 with uh, this this is also D0 from D15 and read and write operations are going to WE bar and these are like connected and from A20 to A0 this uh, going to this pen this and this and these three pins are going to chip select pin so I have uh, selected the chips and others are going to be the uh, like, the, uh, like this and this is the ad uh, disadvantage of linear decoding actually that the resources are not being fully used so we will uh, recover it in partial decoding so I will show you the partial decoding in second part. Thank you.